Today, I'll be doing a unboxing and a quick review of the Ormorex Big Blast Target Caps. How this works is you use just your regular standard water bottles or two liter bottles, any type of plastic bottles. And now you inflate, inflate it with the caps, build pressure in it, and then shoot it as a target and listen to it go boom. See, have a blast with your empty bottles. Make your bottles go boom. You use these caps and you use the inflating needles. So it's right here, it says attach it to a water bottle, inflate it, and you shoot at it. And here's the caliber you can use for use with firearms, air guns, bows. These are your blast packs, comes with 10 bottle caps, two inflator needles, which right there, mesh protection bag, which is inside, and a compact foot pump. This is the bigger pack. The smaller pack is actually comes with a, a hand pump. Fits a variety of bottles. You see, it's all sorts of different types. Of course, the bigger the, the bigger the bottle, the bigger the boom stronger thicker plastics also will make us a louder sound they suggest tying it so you don't lose it when it's when it goes exploding easy to inflate compact recycles you still can be recycled all right without further ado let's go ahead and open up this right here's the foot pump it's all pretty much plastic. Push this out, take the lever out of the way. And you fall pump. You attach the needles to the tip right here. That's it. Yeah, it's all plastic. Now you don't you not have to use this. That's not because the needle can be attached to this, a compressor, or for me, I'm going to use this one first, and then I'm going to switch over to this one, see how that works. Okay. That's your belt, blast belt, caps. There's nothing else in there. This is your mesh bag. This is your string to tie the cap suit so you don't lose it. You can tie it just like that inside. This is your, you get two of these needles that you can attach it to the tip of your pump, or you can attach it to the tip of any sort of compressor or any other tool you want to use. Here's the manual. And inside the manual, tells you exactly what pressure that you're supposed to be pressurizing this to. According to this, if it's a thin, if it's a thin walled bottle, water bottle, you just pressurize it to 50 psi. If it's a two liter soft drink bottle, which will be the bigger ones, 80 psi. So pretty much it. So. I'll do a review on my next time after I try it out and I'll post a video on it. It's gonna be fun. All right, guys, till next time, enjoy and stay safe. Don't forget to like and subscribe.